Brad, we're going to do a um, cylinder leakage test on your engine. Here we go. All right, we're starting with cylinder number one. We have the engine at top dead center, firing on number one. This is our leak down tester. It's zeroed. <clears throat> we'll plug this in. And the gauge comes around here to 92% leakage. They're over here in the red. And we can hear air coming out through the valves and through the crankcase. We'll rotate down to the next cylinder in line, which is going to be cylinder number three. And it's going to be, yeah, there's the top dead center mark there. We'll unscrew from here. And our valves are closed. <clears throat> and we'll move over to cylinder number three. screw in easier when you're not under the, under the pressure of the camera. Uh, we've only done a minute 15 seconds. you got time. Go. Alright. Hmm. Agent number three. Recheck our zero. Still at zero. This cylinder is showing a little over 90% leakage as well. It has leakage through the valves as well as through the crankcase. All right, and we'll go on one, three, four. We'll go on to cylinder number four, which is next in the firing order. That's cool. They got the timing marks back on the flywheel, which is what they did the old days. Yeah, this is an early engine. And there's another OT coming up right there. Yeah, so and our up, up at four. valves okay. are loose. This one, recheck our zero, still at zero. This cylinder is at about 88, 89%. Air leakage through the valves. And again through the crankcase. Alright, we'll do number two, which is our last cylinder. And then the fact that I'm able to turn it so easily from the back indicates there's very little drag on the rings. They are not really doing much anymore. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, OT and loose valves. Yep. Number two is the last in firing order. We're still at our zero set mark. And this cylinder is at 94, 95% has a little bit coming through the valves. Can't make my glove whistle on this one. And it's coming through the crankcase as well. It's what we call a leaker. Uh, this engine is going to be, uh, it'll, it'll smoke. If you look, oops, sorry I bumped that. If you look on our leak down gauge, okay. you can see in the recommended zone here, 40% or less is considered low. And a and a freshly rebuilt engine will be more at like five or ten percent leakage. So, excellent. All this right, gives you a point of reference. Anyway, in my assessment, uh, with rings that are passing that much air, uh, they, that means you're going to have uh, low compression, and or the oil control rings are not doing their job, and they're going to it's going to smoke. Yeah, it's going to smoke with the bore scope and the scoring on the cylinder walls. There's going to be places that the rings will not seal. It will pass oil. All right, just want to let you know, 